is a stainless steel core and then it's wrapped in carbon fiber and this joker broke my arrow that is crazy We are in South Africa. We're about two and a half hours outside of a place called Palakwani. Uh, we're right on the edge of Zimbabwe. And we are on day number six of an eight day hunt. It was supposed to be a 10 day hunt. But uh, today the target animal was zebra. I have two tags for zebra that I'm trying to fill. And uh, I believe I just filled one of them. But uh, it's been an awesome, first six days we've already harvested uh, Gimsbach and Paula we shot baboon uh, guinea fowl so it's been a really fun trip my hunting partner madman shout out to Chad madman but uh, he's already harvested a beautiful kudu and a couple of impala himself baboon uh, zebra so he's a uh, he's killing it over here in South Africa as well but we got the phase four right here and I have just reloaded the phase four with a new sever 1.5 because if you can see off into the distance there's a few zebra circling around but we got one zebra down on the ground that zebra read the script perfect he came in about 32 yards gave me almost a perfect broadside shot took my time leveled everything out Just waiting for to see if these zebra are going to come back in so maybe i can fill my second tag but uh stay tuned we're going to go over there and see where the shot placement was the shot looked really really good but uh we're going to go over there see where it hit zebra expired in maybe a minute maybe two minutes hit the ground within the first 30 seconds it was it's a beautiful sight but you guys stay tuned praise god the sun is coming out so we are about 25 minutes after the shot here is the blind we were sitting in give you guys a little tour of where I've been hunting out of and shot was right over there just on that 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 bank over there but uh it's about time we go do a little recovery because we we watched the animal fall so we know it's down but I still want to look at the blood I know the arrow didn't pass through so I want to recover my arrow yeah zebra down zebra down I got a beautiful rug on the way from my wife so that is awesome, man. God is good. So faithful. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Got my arrow. Yeah, yeah. All right. Let's go see if we can... I'm sure it won't be too terribly hard to find blood around here. Oh, yeah. Just a minute ago. All the wind's kicking up. Sorry, guys. I'm on my phone. But just a minute ago, we had a warthog in here. <laughs> rooting up a storm but uh where was the uh, arrow just right here yeah oh okay okay so and i was wondering oh we had hey it buried up to here though funny yeah yeah i think it was a heart shot too so we had really good penetration i don't know if this is going to yeah, there we go. So we have really good penetration. This joker, I'm running <laughs> VAP TKOs. Or no, I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm not running VAP TKOs. I'm running VAP SS, VAP stainless steel. So it is a stainless steel core, and then it's wrapped in carbon fiber, and this joker broke my arrow. That is crazy. Do you want to walk and stalk a giraffe? Walk and stalk a giraffe. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, maybe. They don't look too scared. <laughs> Should we be concerned about that at all? No. No? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if a giraffe is like leading, leading calls of death around here. But uh, let's get on some blood. Fawny, where did he, did he circle around this tree this way? Or he went through here? Yeah? I mean, as soon as he came around though, he was bleeding good.
I think he was bleeding before he ever got over here. Yeah. Yeah. No, right here. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I don't know. This is, this is blood tracking in Africa. A whole lot more different because you're looking for, you're looking for blood on the least little thing. And then right here, you see this spot that's a little bit darker than the rest of it. Then you know it's blood. Really difficult. I mean, it's a whole nother level of tracking around here. Some of the trackers that I've met are, they blow my mind. But we are we already know where Animal is. I mean, he's hes sitting right over there. But I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the blood trail. Um, okay, yeah. So, here is. Yep. And I don't think, I don't think that's Bubbles. I'm pretty sure I got a heart shot. But he started bleeding really good. Let's just see. Okay, I can see tracks here now. And so when he ran off, he ran straight over here and he was already fallen down by the time he hit just on the other side of this bush, somewhere around in this area right here, he was already falling down. So I think it's, it's amazing because we'll be out here and see, I'm looking and I'm doing my best to figure out, I, I jumped off blood but I'm doing my best to figure out, okay, where did he run to? The topography gets a little, everything looks the same <laughs> when you look around, but these, these trackers, they'll be out here and they'll just be doing this number here, just with the arrow, like, oh, yep, yep, this way, this way. And it is just, it blows my mind. But uh, let me see if I can get back on this blood trail. We'll be back in just a second. Another thing I'm learning is a lot of these animals, they will, they will defecate. Oh yeah, okay. Not a lot of blood, though. I, I, I would have thought it was going to be a lot more that will defecate right when they expire. So, but here we are, guys. Wow. Wow. Beautiful male. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. Beautiful. Wow. Oh man, he is rock solid. Did I hit his guts? No, no. no. Threw it under. Oh, that's how thick they are, huh? No. Wow. He feels like a daggum rock. This is something coming from the animal. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hey boy. Hey. Thank you. Huh? Thank you. Huh? This one Bennett is too wet. It's not gonna help us. Yeah. Hey. Thank you. Look at that. Wow. <clears throat> well guys, here He's is huh? He's... You him? Oh. Yeah. Over there. Yeah. Oh, too late for my yeah. Well guys. We are here next to the uh, the first zebra, but not the only zebra we're going to harvest here in Africa. Um, just an amazing, an amazing experience. Just like to say thank you, God, for the opportunity to be out here to hunt. Thank you, Fonny. Hey. <laughs> thank you, Fonny, for being my guide, helping me to calm down when the zebra walk in and I'm shaking and I'm like, he's at 32 yards. <laughs> thank you, Madman, for teaching me basically everything that I know about pulling that string back and here it is guys beautiful zebra how much do you think he weighs funny in pounds huh in pounds yeah four five hundred pounds maybe how about in kilos and we'll do the math later kilogram for one, 360. 360 kilos no. yeah all right okay let's see if we can flip them over so we can get the uh the entry So we're about to use the winch, load up the zebra, and then we're gonna hop back in the blind, hopefully fill tag number two today. We'll see if the animals wanna cooperate, but this one cooperated pretty good, man. South Africa. Hey, Fonny, you got anything you wanna say? I'm very happy, good shot. <laughs> good shot. Yeah, thank you. Thank you uh, again, man. Just 
thank you, uh, Wild African Safari ZA. Thank you so much for hosting us. It's been such a good time already. Uh, thank you, Madman, for uh, the opportunity to tag along with you. Thank you for believing in me. Um, you know, thank you so much for um, all the guys at the, the Veteran Foundation. I hope I'm getting that right. But the Veteran Outdoors Foundation, thank you guys. It's just, it, it's been such an amazing opportunity. And last, but you know, you're definitely not least. Thank you, Shauna, for, for putting up with me while I'm going on this trip and being able to be all pregnant without me. And my boy Asher in the future, when you see this one day, I just want to let you know something, buddy. Don't ever be afraid to take the shot. Even if you think you might miss and even if you're nervous, take the shot. Take the shot. Be brave enough to take the shot. So, South Africa, man, my first zebra. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Hey. <laughs> I mean, perfect on that triangle. Perfect. That's what I said to the Yeah. Take the video with it. Yeah. So now we know. We yeah. Hit the triangle. Right? Oh, yeah. Hit the triangle. That's it. That's where it's at. Yeah. So that was. Yeah. If you've ever wondered how in the world do you get the animals on the truck once you've shot it, what do you do with it? You have help. 